All right, here we are. So hi, everybody. Thanks for joining in. If you're watching this after the live version, that's great. We're glad you could catch it. We thought we would record it for those of you that couldn't watch live. So my name is Jennifer Lopez Dorsey, and I am your platinum leader. And this is... <laughs> hi, I'm Jen Fryer. <laughs> Jen's probably the one that got you in all, to all this crazy oil stuff. Yeah. So um, you're, you're the one who knows me. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, Jen and I met, oh man, 10 or more years ago. A long time ago, yeah. Mutual friends. And then we kept in, tra kept, um, in touch through Facebook. And then one day she's like, I think I want to try these oils. And I was like, okay, let's go. <laughs> so, and it's been awesome ever since because Jen knows her stuff. You guys know she knows her stuff. So I'm getting my water ready. So I always drink my water when I'm putting oils in it in a metal or uh, not plastic, but a metal or ceramic or glass container. And um, I'm gonna tell you a little secret. Here's tangerine. So tangerine in this bottle and tangerine in the Vitality line, or very soon we will see it in the Plus line for Canada. It's the exact same quality oil, just in a different bottle. So I'm seriously going to drop that into my water. If you are not comfortable ingesting oils, that's okay. It took me a while before I was, and um, but I do it all day, every day now. I know people that have done it for over 20 years, and I know people that will never do it, never try it, never will, and that's okay too. So if you hear noise in the background, that's my family. And mine uh, too. <laughs> okay. All right. This is real life. This is just how it is. So, Mine are bouncing a ball in the hallway right now. So there. <laughs> um, and you'll see this little gem behind me. Oh. <laughs> Hi. So this is the Desert Mist Diffuser. And um, this is a new diffuser that they just came out with in, at convention in June in Utah. And it's amazing. So you're going to see more and more of this guy in Canada. It's available now. But just so you guys know. We can actually purchase American side and Canadian. And I really want to encourage you guys to try other products and really just change your mindset and redirect your spending. So um, if you're sitting there going, I got the kit and I'm good, you probably are for the first little bit. But know that Young Living has over 900 products. Jen and I use them religiously every day. And it's been a slow process, right? Jen, didn't you find like you were... Yeah, I, I, a lot of times I waited for my other stuff to run out before I... But then I was always in the back of my mind, okay, when this runs out, I'm going to try the shampoo. Or like next time I have to buy shampoo and conditioner, I'm going to try this. Or next time I have to buy dish soap, I'm going to try the Young Living one. Just yeah. because I'm making an order anyways, so I might as well give it a whirl. And uh, yeah. it turned out when I, the time that I bought this, the, the Thieves stuff, I was waiting forever for it to run out. And then I was like, why didn't I try this stuff earlier? <laughs> yeah, it's like we have all this chemical stuff in our house and we're like, well, we spent the money on it, so you might as well. But I just yeah. I, finish off I, this bottle. I know. I don't get that because it's a chemical. And if you Google it and you know how dangerous it is for you, you will never touch that stuff again in your life. We've been chemical free in our house for over 10 years or close to 10 years. And um, it's a process. It is a process, it's but a it's a process to get chemical. <laughs> I find that it's like, it's either one or the other. So you either come into oils where you got, okay, the mindset of I'm going to start being healthier. I'm going to eliminate chemicals or this is like the final step or one of the final steps in just taking that health, you know, and you're in being natural to the next level. So, I mean, it's different for everybody, but if you have your kit and you haven't touched it yet, what are you doing? <laughs> get, get that thing open and start using it. So one of the little things that I'll tell you when you first start using your oils that makes it the easiest is don't put stuff away. Leave it out. Like get a nice plate or find a nice tray or something you already own even. You don't even have to buy anything and just put your oils out because if you're looking at them, you will use them. Right? So I want to show you guys actually one of my favorite oils. So maybe Jen, you've never even heard of this one. It's called can you see it? The glare is that. No, it's glare. Egyptian gold. Oh, no. Okay. I've never even heard of it. <laughs> no. It's one of my favorites. I actually got it in my silver and six kit. So listen what it's got. It's got frankincense, lavender, Idaho balsam fir, myrrh, spikenard, hyssop, cedarwood, rose, and cinnamon. Oh, I don't even know how much this bottle is. I don't care. Because it's so good. So I wear my... Here's another little tip. I wear my oils like perfume. So one, two, three, 
breathe that in a few times, that's called opening the bouquet and it actually increases the frequency of your oil, which means you're just gonna get even more benefit out of it. But it smells really good. So if you have really sensitive skin and you can't put your oils on your skin like straight, like I'm doing, then just put in a bit of coconut oil. But I've got real tough skin and my kids do too, so we put it all on meat, they call it, without a carrier oil. So carrier oil is just like a fatty oil, like olive oil, which I wouldn't use olive oil, but just to give you an example, avocado oil, coconut oil. I use grapeseed oil. Oh, yeah, grapeseed's great because it doesn't stain. and It's not as greasy, I don't think. Yeah, but the, I actually love Young Living's B6 oil, so I don't know if you've used that. I have it. I haven't tried it yet. It's in yeah. the cupboard. It's really nice and um, it has, it really doesn't have any smell. It's not greasy. It's kind of like grapeseed and it comes with a pump, which is awesome. So I keep all my old bottles and then um, sometimes I'll make like, I'll buy, I have the roller balls that I get on the, that you can get for the top. So you get one in your kit, but you can order packs of 10 and I'll fill like a 15 mil bottle about quarter of the way with the actual essential oil. And then I top the rest up off with V6 and then put the roller ball on the top. So that's great for oils like, um, like pan away or wintergreen or uh, ones. The ones yeah, that peppermint, like those ones, if you want those straight, that's good. Or digize. Um, so those are good. But so, uh, Jen, what's like when you got your kit, what was the first oil you pulled out of it? I'm actually curious. Um, the first one, uh -huh. um, I think I cracked all of them and gave them smell for oh, cool. all, like, just like all of them and smelled them. But I bought the kit with a, with an intention. I, the very first time I, I'm a just, I have to justify spending to myself. So the very first time I got the kit, I bought it with the intention of saving myself money on, um, Christmas presents for my teach, my kids' teachers. So I was thinking lavender. I was thinking, um, lemon peppermint, and I was thinking eucalyptus. And so I bought a eucalyptus in my second month. And I made bath salts for all of the teachers, for all of the teacher gifts. So that was sort of me thinking, okay, I want this kit. And I don't know how to justify spending, you know, the $200 right now. It's, it's September. It's almost Christmas time. So I've been doing this about a year, a uh, year and a bit now since I got my kit. And um, that, was, that was how I sort of displaced my spending because I, I'm thinking, okay, I have kindergarten. So um two teachers in that classroom we had um a spec ed teacher who we bought something for we had a music teacher who both my kids had we had my son's teacher we had um the before and after lady that looks after them and we had a tutor so i'm like okay we're gonna buy <laughs> starbucks gift cards for 20 you have two kids each, right and i have two kids right i, I had just talked about yours so i'm like i'm gonna buy six or seven like $20 gift cards for something like for wherever. Yeah. And I did the math and I'm like, I could also make a bunch of other stuff. And it went so far. I did. Yeah. I used like three or four, I don't know, three or four drops in each of them. And, um, and had all of these awesome get like, they were big. Like I got the, the half Mason jars and filled those with an Epsom salt and sea salt blend. And, we did it all together. The kids were putting stuff in and we made like an energizing one. Oh, I did one with pan away for like sore oh, muscles. Mm -hmm. And, um, so I read about what all the oils sort of would help with what their sort of natural health benefits were. And everyone knows lavender. And I was like, okay, well, teachers, they're going to need a pep up. They're going to need some sore muscle <laughs> ones. I'm like, okay. So made a bunch of different ones. And then I gave some as, um, as gifts to coworkers and, people who had like helped me out. I'm a, I'm an in an LTO now, but I'm a supply teacher. So some people would help me out and, you know, just been generous with their time and other people who like from skating, who just were good friends of mine, rather than spending that, you know, 10, $15 on a yeah, gift card that everyone's going to be like, Rrr. I made this like counter full of oils and all the teachers got three and whatever. It was just, I was like, okay, for 200 bucks, I would spend way more than that on all of those gifts. And it sort of worked out well. So I had all of these ones that I was trying as well in the bath and learned some stuff about oils in the, in the meantime. So it's a 
sort of long story, but no, but that's, I love that idea yeah. of the gift giving, especially like we have four kids and there's probably close to 20 people in the school that we have to gift to it's madness, all, right? Like helpers, the secretary, the principal, the crossing guard, you know, like all those people you want to say thank you to that help raise your kids during the day. Yeah. And it's important. And so it's funny that like when you make those things, a bar, a jar of Epsom salts is going to cost you less than $5 but it's so beneficial for them and it comes from the heart because you made it with love and care for them and they like they actually really appreciate it and a lot of the teachers come back um and say thanks and like what was that <laughs> and, and really to be quite honest as a teacher yeah the yeah. epsom salts those types of gifts are are great but like sometimes you get gifts that are like the the handmade random chocolate but like <laughs> For, I don't know what kind of, re and you're just sort of like, thank you. Do I eat this or don't I? <laughs> yeah. It's going over here. I really liked those cookies. <laughs> they were very, <laughs> they were so good. <laughs> That's so funny. Okay. So you're like, you're one of the brave ones. You just opened it up. I know people that get their kit and they're like, number one, they don't even know it's a double bot. Like it's a two story bot. Oh. No, I was right into it, right into it. And <laughs> so, like my, and my very favorite oil is Northern Lights Black, Black Spruce yeah. and it was like right under the bottom. And I, the soon as I opened it, I was like, oh my God, this is the best <laughs> thing I've ever smelled in my life. But some people don't like it and whatever. I don't know what's wrong with them, but. Um, <laughs> I don't know what's wrong with them. I love it. Um, but I mean, I like, I don't like some of the smells, but I. I'm getting there. Like it, they're still on my counter and I, I use them when I need to. And I well, don't know. And that, you know, you bring up a good point is you're not, you're not going to like the smell of everything. There's probably over 300 oils now blends and then, um, singles. And it's impossible to like every single one, but over time, as you use them, you'll find that you've trained your brain. And like, even though if you don't like it, you know, it works. So I'll give you an example. Thieves. I hated cinnamon two years ago. I couldn't My mom stand hates the smell of thieves. Yeah. Yeah. And like a lot it's of people, around. Too. a lot of people, cause it's the cinnamon and the clove. And like, I just did not like that smell, but it worked so well on my kids that we had to diffuse yeah. it every day when they came home to just keep our health, our house happy and healthy from cough and cold. Mm -hmm. And, um, and now I can't get enough cinnamon. Like I actually put it in my coffee. <laughs> I put thieves in my coffee too, actually. Yeah. I use it as tea because I, I just, I find that I don't need to have an extra coffee in halfway through the day if I have a hot beverage. And then I, I started doing it when I had a sore throat once. Yeah. And it just, yeah. It's sort of just been a soothing drink in the afternoon rather than yes. having an extra coffee. You know so, what's good too if you have like some discomfort in your throat? Copaiba, a lot of people do, and just some warm water, lemon. That's the first one I ran out of, actually. Oh, really? So it's what Copaiba. do you like Copaiba for the most? Um, I liked it for um, just like sort of general aches and pains. I used it topically and I used it in the bath, but I used it for skin as well. Yeah. I, that's one of the reasons I wanted to try oils in the first place is because I had all these like breakout skins. I've got thinning hair and I was seeing all this stuff on Pinterest to try different blends of oils yeah. to, um, to sort of remedy that. And um, I noticed the biggest difference in my skin, just the, not so much the the redness, but just the, the smoothness, I think of, um, and maybe like it's getting more, um, moisture than it normally would, but I added frankincense and copaiba to, um, just an unscented before I bought, the, before I got the other, um, plant-based face stuff. Cause I'd spent a lot of money on this other face cream. Yeah. So yeah. I added it to my face creams and, um, and I liked the smell of Copaiba. I think it was a really sort of mellow smell at the beginning. Wild. So um, I used that just on my skin um, and, in, um, and in other stuff that I would blend. Um, I'm sort of a DIY person, so it didn't take me long to sort of just try stuff and just, you know, figure it out as I went and, you know, like put three drops of lavender, three drops. I love the smell of... Um, purification as well so I would like three drops of this three drops of that three drops of the black spruce because I really like that smell a little bit of frankincense and like fill the rest with water shake it up and like people are like what is that smell? Where'd, you get that? where'd you get that spray and 
What is that you're wearing? You get that yeah. all the time too, right? Yeah, that smells so good. But and you know, uh, like, I love how you just, you were saying how you just kind of mixed and you just tried it because so many people are afraid of just trying it. Like they're afraid they're going to do it wrong and you really can't. All you do literally is crack the bottle open, yeah. breathe it in, put a drop or two in your diffuser. Like I've done blends where I'm like, that was not a good blend. Oh yeah. There's, <laughs> some, there's some that do not work. Yeah. But, um, and some that I have never even thought of, I went, I go to every month to pick up my order because I work in Brampton. So, Oh, um, the experience center. Yeah. So quite, I go to the experience center every month and I offer that to my members. I it, cause most of them live around me or work with me and say, okay, I'm going to save you the shipping. I'm going to go and pick up my order up. That's they all awesome. know when my date is. So th they'll put theirs in by that date. And, um, some of them don't live near me and they'll either meet up with me or whatever. But, um, I was in there the other day and I was like, what is that? Like, it smells great, but I, I can't put my finger on what it is. She's like, Oh, it's a, it's a blend. It's peppermint and peppermint. I, it's not one that I use a whole lot. And it's one that's I, people use that like crazy all like, day long. Yeah. I don't get a ton of headaches. I know that Lindsay pharmacist uses it like crazy as well. And I'm just like, not one that's in my regular like roster, <laughs> but, um, I, they had it mixed with joy and oh. I, I had not like, and to me, joy, I don't love because it's very floral. Like it's yeah. just so strong to me. I like the smell of it, but I don't, it's just too much sometimes. So yeah. they had that mixed with peppermint and lemon. And I was like, Oh, okay. I'll give that a whirl. Mm -hmm. So I never really diffused peppermint, so I have that going right now. Actually, joy purification and peppermint mixed together, like one drop of each, because the bottle says eight drops in your diffuser. No. Not in my house, like <laughs> two or three. Yeah, <laughs> make make that stuff last as long as it can. But it it you know it really does help to to wake me up in the morning and. Yeah, well, peppermint is great for waking you up. It, it improves your memory. It um, so you might not want to use it at night if it does wake you up because sometimes it keeps people asleep and they can't get to sleep, which is not. I don't a, have a problem with that. Um, yeah, me neither. <laughs> it's great for digestive. Um, it also like I use it before I go to the gym in the morning because um, I was watching a video done by what is his name? Not Doctor Woolley. Who's the other one? Doctor. Oh, I can't remember his name. Anyways, um, he did this test where they actually like hooked up um, like wires to his brain and then he would breathe in oil and then they would read his brain waves and the brain would change color. So it would go green or red and that would indicate like what was happening in the brain. So he would say what he had known this oil to do and then the person administering the test would say like, yeah, that's actually truth and this, this is what was going on. So one of the things they said in that video was that um, peppermint increases your grip strength by 10%. So oh. it stronger. And I was like, that's cool. So I put that on before the gym and, um, I, I love it for just w like waking me up. If you're in the car even, and it's kind of stuffy, that's a nice one to put on or to put like, I have a car diffuser, but if you don't, you could do like a cotton ball in the, in the vent or some people have like a wooden clothes peg and they just drop it on the wood and then it blows it into the car and it just freshens up the whole car. It's awesome. It keeps you awake in the car for sure. Nice. Yeah. So, and it's like, um, in the summer, uh, if you put some on the back of your neck, just neat. Oh, it's like cool. Because oils are photosensitive, you guys. <laughs> so just be careful. Like you can burn something fierce, but you know, if it's, if you're not going to be in the sun or your hair is covering the back of your neck and you put that on, it's like a, an air conditioner it really cools you down because it's a hot oil. So sort of like, um, deep cold or a five, three, five, that's sort of yeah. the feeling that you get on your skin of just that, even like it's an alcohol swab when it, yeah. Um, evaporates off. It's that sort of feeling um, that you would get on, a, and same with Panaway and um, those other sort of like muscle soothing oils. Um, that's what you're going to get from that, and that's why they work on headaches because they're helping to relax all of those cervicogenic muscles back there. Um, and I'm talking like a chiropractor. Okay, you you guys don't know Jen's a chiropractor, <laughs> which is really awesome. Not anymore, but I went oh, no. through all of the training and uh, yeah, I earned you're that. A chiropractor, DC. you're just not practicing yeah. at the moment. <laughs> yeah, I I earned that DC, but yeah. Um, yeah, all the all the little muscles in the back of your head. If you get tension headaches, and it's because those little muscles go like this during the day. If you put those oils on there, 
it helps to relax those muscles, then all the blood can get back into your brain and recirculate through your body and those muscles will relax a little bit and uh, get you back to normal. Oh, here she comes. She's, she's so the other oil that it was, what's that? She's stealing my, uh, your markers or my pens. Yeah. <laughs> um, Not that she hasn't got a, a million. Anyways, you go ahead. use frankincense. Are you like a Frank user? Um, I'm out of frankincense, right? Okay, so that means yes. So yeah, like I me. actually put it like here you on my head yourself. in the morning. <laughs> yeah, I I don't know. It just makes me feel like I've like started my day. And yeah. I use it for um, I used to use it for meditation a lot when I had it um, in, <laughs> and I use it on my, some. <laughs> I think that's why I um, I'm out of it because I put it on my skin so much. I just like every night like right yeah. before bed straight like, is one of those oils face. like it's that little bottle that comes in your kit's 55 dollars. the fact that it's even in the kit and it costs a quarter of what the bat yeah. like what you're paying for the kit is crazy it's great for your skin it's great for your mental health um it it's just one of those ones that actually like it calms you and it uplifts your spirits um, it's mentioned in the Bible over 55 times. I always say if it's good enough for Jesus. It's good enough for me. <laughs> I will use it. That's why I typically like a lot of blends that have frankincense and myrrh in them because combined they're so powerful. That's what they anointed Jesus with. And, um, they're, they're really amazing. Um, the, the healing power of them is amazing. And you just feel so good when you use them. Um, I think for me, it's that like, it helps me just to like sit, like, things get crazy at school sometimes and I, or here and sometimes at night I just need to like, okay, if I'm yep. going to meditate, I'm just going to like, yeah. Sit. What do you want, honey? <laughs> what do you want? What nothing... else is in the... I'm trying to think of like, so purification, yeah. like I use that all the time. So I use it on my dryer balls and my, yeah. I hurt myself. And, um, so I just to kind of clean it up before I put a bandage on, I dropped that on. And actually, so marjoram was the free oil last month, right? When you did a hundred PV yep. on essential rewards. So I'm going to tell you a little bit about marjoram because people are like, I don't know what this oil is and I don't know what to do with it. I did a huge post on my uh, fan page on Facebook. So if you guys want to go over there, I constantly teaching on that page. Um, it's just Jennifer Lopez Dorsey YL is the name of it. And, um, Marjoram is good for, it's basically like lavender. So la they say lavender is like the Swiss army knife of the essential oil world. So if you ran out of every other oil and you didn't know what to do, grab your lavender because it's great for so many things. So marjoram is kind of the same thing. Marjoram is also found in the um, raindrop technique. And so marjoram is great for bumps, bruises, burns, uh, digestive issues. It's good for arthritis. It's good for headaches. It's good for cough and cold, eczema, dermatitis, like Pretty much everything that could go wrong in your body or that you need support with, it helps. So I've also been using marjoram on this because my first instinct is purification, right? Purify, clean. Um, and then I was like, why am I not using my marjoram? And I have a big 15 mil bottle because I, I do use it quite often. So whenever we get um, every month, the promos change, right? So this month, this month is incredible. If you guys are not on Essential Rewards, this month is crazy. They double up. They did this last year, and I can't believe how much. Literally, you spend three to four hundred dollars. You buy your oils and you buy your groceries because we got toothpaste, shampoo, and all your Christmas presents. Right? Yeah, and all your Christmas presents, right? Unique, useful gifts, and even if people get double, they don't care because they're going to use it. Um, and they now are doubling up. So last month when you did a hundred ER, they did marjoram. This month you get two pine. The next, so if you do a hundred PV, you get on a Century Rewards, you get oils. 190, 250, 300 PV, you're getting oils. And you can do an order on the Canadian market and you can do an order on the American market. So on the American market, they have different oils, but if we have any of those oils on the Canadian market, they won't send you the product. Instead, they just give you the product credit, which is great because you can buy whatever you want. Um, you can buy that product that you were supposed to get or anything on your wish list. Um, but so you're spending like 300 PVs, it's anywhere from 350 and up, depending on what you buy. You're literally getting over a thousand dollars worth of product because of all the free stuff that they give you. So there's um, there's two pine, two uh, peppermint, two northern lights, black spruce. I forget the other ones. I can't remember. Um, three hundred frankincense is the three hundred, but I'm not. Oh, yeah, yeah. Mine's not that high. Oh, you got You got to get that one, Jen, and try it because um, and you'll get two. <laughs> well, I'm not frankincense is it's a bit of a sweeter smelling oil than regular frankincense. Um, 
Regular frankincense, I love for my skin. Um, it is calming. I find sacred frankincense, it makes me smarter and it makes me funnier. That's how I describe it. It just, it just makes me feel like all warm and fuzzy. I love it. And I think the 250 is, no, it's not cinnamon. Maybe it's cinnamon. Cinnamon bark. Cinnamon bark, yeah. Yeah, that's a great Double one. I love that. Yeah. But so, I stopped okay. at the Northern Lights. I was like, oh, Northern Lights? <laughs> <laughs> I'm in for 190. Yeah, like 190 and to get, so you get two pine, two Northern Lights, and two peppermint. I, I don't yeah. even know the value of that. I'd have to figure out. Sure, Northern Lights is about 55 a bottle, right? Uh, well, it's only a five mil that you get, I think. The 15 yes. mil is like 60. Okay. Yeah. So say it's like 20. Yeah. It's, it's, it's a good, it's a good gift. Yeah. Well, so, I, I'm selfish. I keep it all for myself. <laughs> No, I mean, it's a good gift from Young Living. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I think, like, um, yeah. I, I, it's, Nor it's, Northern Lights is a real – okay, so Northern Lights is new, right? That, like, that just came out um, not this past November, but, like, the November before. So I think it's just – it's less than two years it's been around. I and they love grow it. it in British Columbia. Um, so it's a Canadian oil. I call it the sexy lumberjack oil. It's like, imagine a warm – moist forest with like the sun just kind of streaming in and you look yeah. in the distance and there's that sexy lumberjack walking it at you. It smells like fresh. It smells like fresh. <laughs> um, I don't know. It, it's just so it's very grounding. grounding and beautiful smelling, but like, I mean, there's some of the wood oils that, that smell very harsh. Like I feel like balsam fir is like when I, when I get a nose full of that, it's I'm fresh. Like, wow. <laughs> that is woodsy. But yeah. like, it's more like Irish spring, but this one is just sort of like fresh cut wood. Like it just yeah. smells like cozy cottage. cottage. Yeah. Like you walked into Tara and they've just put out all the trees, right? It's like, yeah. <sighs> yeah well the awesome. frequency of the northern lights is the equivalent of the feeling of love so when you put that on you do feel that like warm fuzzy yeah it's comforting feeling awesome feeling like i put that on every single day oh good well i'll I, tell you though i'll okay. tell you if you ever slam your hand in something like a car door or you bang something and it's got like a pulse if you put northern lights on and you just kind of hang on to it for a minute that pulse disappears it's awesome for that so I really, I really like that and then you know like there's so many different things you can do with your kit um and all the oils that come in it right you've got 11 oils so my advice I'm totally naked oh I'm on camera <laughs> <laughs> you never know it's like mine had a random bouncy ball and was getting dry erase markers <laughs> here's his naked flashes the flash oh man oh now he's hiding he's like I'm sorry I'm like it's okay everybody just saw your butt <laughs> Is that the one that wasn't feeling good? Hope you're feeling no, good. <laughs> no, that was Alex. Roman was staying home today. So Al, Roman wasn't feeling well. So he woke up and he's like, you know how when it's like right here? This is right. Uh, it's like right here and you feel like you're going to get sick. So what's the first thing we did, buddy? Um, probiotics, Life 9. Took our pro, I took my probiotics. Uh -huh. You took your Mighty Vites? Yeah. Um, yeah. And your, and your Mighty Zymes. Yeah. So they take enzymes, multivitamins, uh, Life9 probiotics, and Ningxia. <laughs> mine, so, do, mine do the multivitamin. Yeah. So, like, you know, his stomach's feeling a little uh, not so good. And like, well, I don't want to send him to school because you just don't know how it's going to progress. So we did Ningxia in coconut water because coconut water has natural electrolytes and, then fizzy water. and we put a little bit of fizzy water in there sparkling water just because you know sometimes that calms your belly and um he, he drank still, that still really aching though it's still yeah we well, really had a rest hurting. but typically before like if we hadn't have done all that stuff this would have progressed to vomiting and diarrhea i you did vomit this morning well you didn't but okay <laughs> it's yeah. like <laughs> I, they say vomit like you actually threw up yeah, a little. like in your mouth and then swallowed it again that doesn't count yeah that's not that's like I didn't do that. Uh, yeah no uh -oh. <laughs> so um you know they just kind of kind of keeps it where it's at and then tomorrow he's gonna be yeah. back to normal so what would have knocked him out for who knows how long is actually only like one day ish and um we really like that's about the most we get in our house, which is awesome. So, yeah. Thanks, bud. Okay. See ya. Bye.
<laughs> okay, let, let mommy finish. I'm tired. I know. Go, go see daddy. He's decorating. I, I, we have a, our, we have our Christmas open house tomorrow. Nice. No, you should see the status of my house. <laughs> we're still like trim everywhere. We're renovating. It's not good. Um, the other thing that is awesome that we want to talk about is Thieves Cleaner. So this is an old bottle. The new ones are all white. But Thieves Cleaner, so this is the 14-ounce bottle, and then there's a really big one. So I get the big bottle, which is it's a, about $100, but you get 150 500 mil bottles. So you take a cap full put it, I did, this is just from the dollar store. I put, I put two catfuls in because four kids and a dog, lots of dirt in my house, lots of grease and stuff. Um, this bottle, you'll get about 30 bottles out of. So this is $27 and change and you get 30 bottles. It's, I mean, it's amazing. So what do you put it on? What do you yeah. use it for? I use that for everything. I think the when I got the thieves kit, um, I, that's the first thing I used. I cleaned my oven. Like I, first I made the concoction. Oh. So I diluted it and I made a strong batch first. So I did the, I did a two, uh, two capfuls and I bought some bigger dollar store ones. They look like the ones that a janitor would have. Oh, and, yeah. um, so like, I think they're 750, 750 milliliters. And, um, I filled those, I, and I cleaned the oven first and then I clean, like cleaned my whole kitchen. I cleaned. Um, my car, I cleaned the, um, my car seats, like I sprayed it on the car seats and scrubbed them like inside my car and the kids' car seats. And, um, I just got one of those dish, those Ikea dish yeah, yeah. thingy. The dish brush. Yeah. Yeah. The dish brush. And I sprayed down all of the seats of my inside of my car and scrubbed, scrubbed, scrubbed. It was like the end of the winter last year. So the spring of last year. I did all my the mats inside my car and scrubbed all of those mats and all of the the rubber mats that were on top of them. Um, that was like my crazy thieves day. Um, and I cleaned some things that were sort of stinky too. Like I took a couple of shirts that had been in the dryer for too long or in the washing machine overnight. Yes. Yeah. And I took them out and it, like they've just been sort of a little stinky ever since. And if you start to sweat, then it comes out even more and you're like, yeah. Oh my God, this is bad. So I took, I put those laid them out in my kitchen floor and like sprayed them all down. And uh, then I put them back in the wash and tried because I got the detergent with the laundry detergent with them as well. And uh, what else did I clean? Uh, all the, all the surfaces basically in my whole house, my whole, um, all of my bathrooms. Um, yeah, it's it's good for everything. Actually, it works so on everything. The windows, the everything. It replaces everything. Like all of the cleaners are now gone. Um, the, the clothing thing. So here's a something I've kind of playing around with it. That happens a lot, right? Yoga pants get a smell sometimes. Yeah. Like it happens. My kids have certain kinds of clothes that is like a shiny T-shirt. I was yeah, almost. I don't know how to explain it. They the Under Armour uh, stuff, but yeah. the cheap Under Armour, not the yeah. real. Yeah, yeah, like the Walmart stuff. So. Yeah. For the yeah. Costco stuff. Um, so I do a cap full of Thieves Cleaner in a sink full of hot water, and I just soak it, cover it up, let it soak for a few hours, wring it out. I don't rinse it. I just wring it, throw it in the machine with some Thieves Laundry Soap, and that takes the smell away every single time. Yeah. And it's great. It's, like I, there's been times where I didn't think that the smell would ever come out. Yeah. And it actually does with this stuff. And um, yeah. even I'll use the, I'll use purification in the dryer balls, and that That's is... A good idea. Um, that works great. Um, so we have dryer balls sometimes. too. If, in case people don't know, yeah. there, we have packs of four dryer balls, and it comes with a little bottle, a five mil bottle. Some people might be getting it for Christmas from me. So I'm just <laughs> people in my family. <laughs> um, so that's available. Um, but yeah, there's a thief starter kit. If you guys want Ningxia, though, don't buy the Ningxia starter kit because it's cheaper to get it on Essential Rewards. So if you don't know what Essential Rewards is, Jen's going to tell you why she loves Essential Rewards so much. <laughs> Essential Rewards basically is, um, it's a loyalty program. So I like it because I replace something every month and there's always some things that I need to replace. Um, so I like, it's just great. And then you got a ton of free stuff and then every three or six months or whatever, you get more free stuff. And yeah. it's just, 
it ends up paying for itself. Um, well, you get so much. That's what, people don't get how much free stuff you get when you're on ER. At so, first, I didn't think I needed it. I was like, I, I don't need all this stuff. Like, there, and there's been months in my first year. I was like, I don't, I don't need any more. I don't need anything this month. There's nothing I need. But I literally, and I've gone through this with a couple of people. I, I laid out with a calendar or like a one sheet, like an eight and a half by eleven, and wrote down every person's birthday or every event that I would be buying presents for people and sort of organized it that way. So yes. I'm, okay. Just a minute. I love where you're going with this. You are so oh. organized. <laughs> so I literally go through month by month. And so, so September is crazy for us. We got like three or four family birthdays. We've got like end of the summer. Like, so I spread it out and I think, okay, if I'm going to spend a hundred dollars a month rather than you know, $200 in this month and, you know, all of my end of the year. Um, my June is crazy because I have all these teachers to buy for and all this other stuff. So I spread it all out and figure, okay, well, Mother's Day is coming and yeah. Father's Day is coming and all of these things that I'm going to buy for. So if I tack on a uh, lavender body lotion, I'm going to give at least two away because we got two mothers in our, like, you know, three mothers, whatever. Um, can you please, thank you. <laughs> it's like they know, good grief. I'm really trying to focus, but no, they, um, we, we've got stuff coming up. So I, I just spread it all out. And then if I don't need anything that month, I'm like, okay, I know that I have mother's day. I know that I have, you know, and that's going to be a busy month. <laughs> She's got a tape measure now. I don't know <laughs> measuring. I can't be putting them to work. <laughs> Uh, so anyways, I, I spread it all out like that and then figure, figure out what I'm going to do for Christmas and this and that. And, um, it, it ends up working out and then I get all this free stuff that I can either give away as presents to, or, um, keep for myself. And yeah. Say, Yay. Well, well, this it, is a free, free, free thing that I need to try this month or yeah. that I've never tried before. And, and that's true. A lot of this stuff is people have never tried it. So it gets it in your hand and it's free. So you're like, okay. And then you try it and then you fall in love with it. And you're like, wow, there are so many other products I've never tried before. So you do get free oils quarterly in your first year. Um, the 12 month oil is called loyalty. I just got that one. Hey, you cannot buy this oil. It is. I just got it. Yeah, it's it's a great oil. It is it's got I think like four or five different like young living blends it's good. in it. It's sort of an earthy one too, but I I I like those. I didn't think that I would. I thought I would be more and I really love citrus the citrus ones. Yeah, yeah. Like I've You're gotten tangerine for free that I never would have bought otherwise, but I love it. Like I love it in water. I love it it's going upstairs blended with um, Northern Lights right now. Oh, that's a good um, mix. Tangerine and Northern Lights. Tangerine and Northern Lights is really Christmassy because, you know, people like their tangerines or oranges oh. at Christmas. Well, and anytime you add citrus to a diffuser blend, I find it sweetens it up. So whatever it is, yeah. like you're saying, Joy is very florally, but with yeah. citrus, mm -hmm. citrus, it kind of like calms it down a little bit. But Joy is my mom's favorite. Like, she <laughs> loves, like... I would have never moment. guessed that. I would have guessed your mom was more of like a woodsy lover. Like, you know, this. No, she, that's the first one she saw online was like, she's like, I was looking at the rose and then I saw how much it cost. And I was like, yeah. well, I'll tell you, Jen, why it costs I them. Eat rose every single day. Every oh. day. Cause, and if you can't afford rose on its own, buy a blend that it's in, right? Gentle Babies yeah. is a really good one. It's in this Egyptian gold one. Um, loyalty, just because people are maybe wondering what's in it. It's got a lot. Angelica oil, ylang ylang, lavender, Idaho blue spruce, cassia, vetiver, sandalwood, geranium, sacred frankincense, patchouli, cardamom, um, what else? peppermint, and melissa, and rose. This one has rose too. So there's a lot. I mean... That bottle, I'm going to guess, would be over $100 because it's of all the good. different oils in it. It's pretty good. I haven't used it a ton yet, but it's yeah. it's on the counter. It's, it's, it gets sniffed once in a while. Yeah. And um, to be honest with you, I wanted to share as well, I there's something that I do as well. with You know how Jen just took the, the back off and she read what the contents were? One of the first oils we bought was Peace and Calming. And in our house, a lot of times we have meltdowns after school. Like we get home and then all of a sudden we're all fighting. And... It's just that witching hour, that crazy. And we got the diffuser and I started putting it in right after school to try and just see what would happen. Like, okay guys, we're gonna put some mellow music on. We're just gonna 
not bug each other for half an hour. <laughs> and they, they literally start, Wade's like, mm, peace and calming's on, we're home, it's time for, like, yeah, and then he would ask for it on a Sunday afternoon. I think we need some peace and calming. And Aww. it's sort of cute, right? Yeah. But um, we ran out a while ago and I hadn't replaced it. And I, so I, I peeled the back off and I was like, okay, what's in here? And if it wasn't for essential rewards, I, pr- I wouldn't have Liang Liang because I wouldn't, if that's a floral oil, I wouldn't be on my list to, to purchase. But I had it because we got it free on essential rewards one year, one, um, one month. Um, so I had Liang Liang, that's in, that's in the blend. I had, I think it has some sort of, or it has an orange or tangerine or something. And I had something close. I was like, okay, it has a citrus. So <laughs> like would throw in some tangerine that I had that was free from essential Awards. And it has a couple other things that I had on hand. And I was like, okay, it's not going to be exactly the same because it doesn't, I don't have any of this, but and it smelled very similar. And I like, like, put it right back in the same bottle, like three Liang Liang, three like orange, and then <laughs> something else, like trying to blend my own. Like it, it wasn't the same, but it, it gave that same sort of like vibe of like, oh, there's familiar smells. I know what's happening. It's relaxing time. Like, and then you ordered Peace and Calming immediately. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, there's something that's dark in Peace and Calming, and I don't yeah. know what, which one that is, but we, I didn't have that one. Mm-hmm. Hmm? It's blue tansy. Blue tansy. Yeah. I don't have blue tansy. That's, that was the only one that I didn't have. So I was like concocting my own brew <laughs> of peace and calming, but like you can do that. And it's similar when you're, when you're getting into it. Like, I, I don't know, maybe I'm well, just a more hands-on person than most people. They're like, what do I do? Yeah. I people know. are scared to try it, but I'm like, just that's throw it in there. <laughs> yeah. Just try it. But the, that's the thing is like, I always think it's kind of a blessing in disguise when you run out of something because you're forced to try something else you have because the oils, a lot of them overlap, you know, like ylang ylang, bergamot, geranium. Those are all, those oils are like, they help with hormonal stuff. So one might be more effective than the other. Sometimes if you blend them all together, you get an even, it's like a, a big, big calming bomb, you know, that, that helps in your house. So that doesn't make yeah. sense. Calm. <laughs> but you know what I mean? Like, it's just like, boom, all of a sudden everybody's calm. So, um, everybody reacts different. Yeah. You got to try them and see how you feel. And if you put something on and you like the smell or it makes you feel good, then keep using it. You know, abundance like, is the other one that I put in my blend now. I love that one. Drink, have you ever put it in your water? No, it's really good in water. Okay. I'll try that tomorrow morning. Yeah. I put abundance on everything, my phone, my computer, my bills. Like I'm, you know, I'm grateful for my bills because without them, I wouldn't have a house to live in and a car to drive. So I put them on. You know what someone says that there's a girl that wrote a book. I forget. She's a USANA person, I think, but she, uh, she calls them. um, What? Why don't you put it on your kids? (laughs) (laughs) I heard that. Um, what did she call them? Oh, um, receipts for blessings deliver already delivered or something like nice. that. Nice. Oh, they're, I like that. That's what bills are. They're not bills. They're, uh, they're, they're receipts, receipts for blessings for, yeah. Receipts for something that's already been blessings. You've yeah, already something received. like that. Something like I love that. that. That's so Which cool. It's sort of cute where it's like, it's not, you know, it's not a negative thing. It's like, oh. you know, someone did a service for you and you yeah. know, have to, you know, replace the, the energy that they gave to you yeah. in money. Well, and um, so I actually, we painted the living room because we're renovating that whole room. So Gary Young had told the story at Canadian convention like two years ago when I went that he put abundance in the paint when they painted his office. So I was like, I'm doing that next time I paint. So now when I paint, I put in purification and abundance because the purification helps with the smell of the paint. And then mm-hmm. abundance just brings you abundance all the time. So, I put purification. I, um, if I'm running late and I don't have time to hop in the shower and I do my, you know, my DIY dry shampoo okay. and, um, like I'll use the lavender soap and then purification and like give myself a shower. <laughs> <laughs> That's awesome. I just do this. I'm just like thieves, thieves all the time. Yeah. <laughs> like some thieves and like, like you, <laughs> even in my mouth I actually it's really good when you have uh discomfort in your throat oh I have the lozenges that's my yeah. my greatest add-on I love the the lozenges are fantastic yeah 
They're good. They're, they're nice and strong. They are strong at the beginning. It's hard to get used to because you're used to like probably candy. Like put awesome. your tongue to sleep because of the yeah. clove in it. Yeah. If you have a toothache, <laughs> yeah. suck on those babies and yeah. then uh, you won't feel it anymore for a yeah. little while anyway. My kids like it too, but yeah, so I guess, you know, we, we didn't really go through, we I went through some of the oils in the kit, but the, the kit. whole point is just try them and use them. And then, you know, this is, you change your mindset, right? So you start thinking, okay, so this happened. Normally I would grab this product instead what can i use young living product that will help with this problem so it's always like what's the problem how can young living be the solution and yeah. as soon as you start changing your way of thinking and that just becomes like your first reaction before you know it you're going to own like every single product there's over 900 products but um don't be afraid to buy on the american side they have lowered the prices on everything so by the time it converts to us a lot of the times it's actually cheaper than if it was on the canadian side and shipping's like a buck or two more so you, it doesn't cost more everybody thinks it's more expensive it's not and they are working on getting everything to the canadian market so we have makeup makeup just arrived this month yes we could that's buy on my december before. order <laughs> like that was all available before but people are sometimes afraid to buy american so um or on the american site so we're unique we're one of the only i think maybe the only country that can actually buy on the american side so we can do uh, an essential reward order in the states shipped to our door we can do one drop shipped in the United States, so that's two. We can do an essential reward order in Canada, that's three. And then we can do another one in Canada. So if there's a special, like Black Friday was mid-month, they did another special, they will allow you to call in and do a second essential reward order on the Canadian side. So you can do two, four essential reward orders a month. Hmm. And um, if I didn't it's know that. special and you want to run a second essential reward order, then um, message me because I got connections <laughs> so we can get it done. But um, yeah, so don't quick order stuff. If you think of, you know, like, cause this, we have till December 10th, by the way, to order for, um, to make sure it gets to us by Christmas. Um, but say you're mid month and you're like, Oh man, I forgot about Susie's birthday and I want to get her, you know, a bottle of lavender, peppermint and lemon or something and make a little thing up for her and you want to do a quick order but you've already done a quick order and there's no sales that's when you would like message me and just say hey i want to do another order and then i go cool put it in your cart um tell me your pin number and your member number and i will take care of the rest and that's it so yeah they're awesome they take care of us here in canada <laughs> they're really good so um and then there's every month there's specials right from young living and then often i do them too so see that diffuser right there that is going to land in somebody's lap <laughs> the next week. I got to do the draw for it. So that was a special I had last month. So, um, yeah, when you do 300 PV and above, usually I have draws and different prizes and things. Last month was crazy. So lots of giveaways. But, um, yeah, and if you guys have questions, you know, utilize the Facebook groups. That's what they're there for. And if you're wondering about something, somebody else is wondering. So it's good to ask and get your questions answered. And if you want to host a class, reach out to, to Jen. If she's your enroller, reach out to her and, um, you know, she can definitely help you. Because that's, you know, you want to introduce this stuff to your friends and your family because, you care about them and you, and why would you keep this stuff a secret? That's crazy. And then if your friends and family purchase, you get kickbacks and it helps pay for your product, which is really nice. So we don't have host rewards. Young living is just like, here's some money. Thanks. <laughs> Thanks for sharing, which is really nice. Um, and you can do that as often or as little as you want, which is nice. And you know, like Jen starting to share more because organically Jen, people are just coming to you, right? Like they're just asking you about it. They're asking me, what's that smell you're spraying on your scarf? <laughs> <laughs> and that's why I started because I like the smell. I thought it smelled nice. And then once I started to, to sort of feel the benefits and see what it was doing for my skin and sort of my mental health, <laughs> it's like, oh, yeah. I was like, okay, I'm going to, and watch some of those uh, crazy Ted talks about animal based products. And then I was like, oh, I'm going to get some more plant based products why don't I just get them from my young living? It's sort of like an Amazon account, right? So like, I, I'm not paying, I'm not paying for this account. So why wouldn't I just order it from them and see what theirs is like? And if I don't like it, then I'll try a different kind. Yeah. No biggie, but I might as well buy it from myself. Now, and, people uh, are always like, what toothpaste is best? And like, buy them all and try them. And you're not buying a car. It's not a huge Yeah. Then, yeah. <laughs> just and if you spend a hundred PV on ER, then you're going to get something for free. Yeah. Yeah. And this month it's going to double up. So that's awesome. Yeah, so it's a good month to do it. It's a good yeah. month to buy gifts and, 
you know, even if you have things coming up in February, like Valentine's Day, and like I, I'm a thinker, a header. Oh yeah, that's yeah, and Wade's birthday, but maybe I'll get him some pieces <laughs> and some like mighty bites. Yeah, yeah. Like, Here, eat these. Yeah. Anyway, that's cool. Thanks for sharing all your stories, Evan. Thanks, Thanks for helping us. All right, no problem. Okay, so thanks for watching, everybody. If you're watching the replay, do hashtag replay below. I'd love to hear it. And if you like what you heard, throw a heart on there and let us know. If you have questions, post below, tag somebody. Um, yeah, that's great. So thanks for watching, everybody. Bye. Thank you.